Hello and welcome to another episode of Elephant English Podcast. In today's video, we're going to be doing the part two of Would You Rather questions with my mum. The first question is, would you rather live in the city or the countryside? I love the countryside. It's very relaxing and I love nature. It's much more relaxing than being in a city. I was recently in Manchester where there were a lot of people in the centre of the city and in the shops and it became very stressful. Have you ever lived in a city then? No, I haven't lived in an actual city, but I've lived in a large town, which was okay. Yeah, I live in a city at the minute and I think that it's a lot nicer when you come to the countryside because you feel that people aren't stressed all of the time. When you're in a city and you see everybody on the underground or on the buses, it feels like they're always rushing to go to work or just to get to different places, but they always seem quite stressed. Yes, and even when walking along the street to the shops, if you want to go to a shop that's on the other side of the street, it's very stressful to cross the road and it just seems very busy all of the time and people don't seem as relaxed as they are in the country. The next question is, would you rather be too hot or too cold? I would rather be cold because you can always add layers of clothing or you can have a fire or heating in your house to become warm again. But when you're too hot, there's very little that you can do to cool yourself down. Yeah, I prefer to be too cold as well. But if you ask me this question in the winter, I might say I prefer to be too hot because at the moment we can't really remember what being cold is. Yes, that's true. At the moment it's been very hot and I can't imagine even putting on a jumper or a coat. So I think it depends what season you're in at the time for this question. The next question is, would you rather be able to talk with animals or speak all foreign languages? I think I would rather be able to speak to animals because I like animals a lot and I think that it would be very interesting to, to find out their opinions of how they're living. Maybe they're happy in their life or maybe they're really unhappy. I think with a dog, though, you can tell if they're happy or not. And when the cat is meowing at you, you kind of know what she's saying. She's saying, I'm hungry, I'm hungry. Yes, but what about a rabbit or a giraffe? They don't say anything at all. So it would be interesting to have their perspective on life. The next question is, would you rather eat a rat or a spider? It would depend if it was cooked or raw, if it was alive or dead. It really depends on the condition of the, the creature. Um, even though I'm vegetarian, I think I would choose to eat the rat if it was cooked. Well, even though you're vegetarian, a spider is meat as well. It would be considered meat, wouldn't it? I suppose so. I've never thought of a spider being... Meat. Yeah. It's just horrible. <laughs> but a rat is definitely meat. Right. Okay, the next question is, would you rather have no water or no electricity? I think I'd rather have no electricity because you can live without electricity. It wouldn't be easy initially. I have lived one weekend without water coming from the taps and it was very difficult to do anything at all. But you don't need electricity to survive all the time. You can use candles for light. You can just eat sandwiches. So it's not so crucial. It's not as important as water. Yeah, I agree. I think when you haven't got water, you can't really do anything. You can't cook. You can't wash the dishes. You can't go to toilet. Yeah, and you just feel dirty all the time, even though you aren't you start thinking of the things you can't do because of the lack of water. Whereas if you haven't got electricity for a few hours, you can soon find something to do. The final question is, 
Would you rather listen to noisy traffic or terrible music? I think I would rather listen to noisy traffic because you soon get used to the noise of of traffic. Yeah, because you used to live near an airport, didn't you? And you soon get used to the planes going by and you don't really notice them. Yes, it's the same with if you live near a motorway. In the end, it becomes background noise. And the same with the aeroplanes. We didn't notice the aeroplane noise. Whereas with music, if you don't like that type of music, it can be very annoying. So in today's video, we've done would you rather questions with my mum. There will be a part three of these questions. So please like this video if you've liked it and subscribe to my channel. Thank you and see you in the next video.